All right, folks, welcome back to the Path of Rage and our ongoing MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries modded playthrough. Uh, this is a good episode. We are trying to recover from the loss of the Clint. Uh, we take on a mission that uh, <laughs> hurts us a lot, and we lose another mech only to gain a better one as a replacement. Uh, this was a really good, uh, fun episode as well to film. I hope you enjoy it. Let's get stuck into the action. Alright folks, let's get back into it. Last episode was a very action-packed episode. We have to find some repairs, uh, get enough money to repair the Clint, because having losing that 45 ton mech, or 40 ton, losing that Clint, 40 ton, really, really hurts. We don't have the money to buy a new engine for him yet. But we need to get that in there. However, I did notice something getting ready to make this episode. That I didn't before. Snowshoe's the guy that keeps getting our mechs killed. This is why. He has absolutely zero ability to reduce incoming damage. He just takes it all. That's why we've lost these mechs so quickly. We are getting rid of him like a sack of hot shit. We'll pick up more pilots on the way. But for now, we are here. And I think we're going to do the ground war contract. Have our repairs ready. Yeah. What about up here? Do we have anything against the clans? I could do this garrison duty, I think. Yeah, let's try it. So, I'm here. <laughs> I was wondering why I didn't travel to it. So, first off, I think we're going to try the Stronghold Defense. And then we'll do the Ground War. Hopefully the Ground War, uh, Stronghold Defense, gives us the ability to... Um, Uh, hopefully it gives us the ability to get another mech, get that Whitworth at the very least. That is a phenomenally good early game mech. I want it. <laughs> but hopefully now we'll stop losing mechs so damn fast thanks to Snowshoe. Oh, I wish I'd noticed that first. That's what I get for not checking out their stats and, and paying attention. Okay. Here we go. Actually, I'm gonna switch to this little dude. Greetings, Commander. This is the base defense system. This base is equipped with the following defense nodes. Over four medium lasers. Absolutely I'll put a tubes. PPC turret up. One anti-air. Three AMS. Two large lasers. I'll take an AMS as well. Three PPCs, one SRM, Three PPCs. two LRMs, nice. four decoys. These are all interior. I need stuff fitting outside. Okay, what is this? Enemy aircraft inbound. Don't need a decoy. Target one. Moving on lands target. Oh, I can't see. Where are we going? Ooh, an LRM 10 turret. Absolutely. Come on. This. The 2 turret. I'll place all the things I can get. I'm just going to keep using the locust here for the time being. Secondary 
Objective acquired. What? Skull unit taking heavy damage. <laughs> I just shot the wrong leg. Damn it. Not gonna lie, I would love to take a cicada. Yeah, I'll take a PVC turret. This here is a scorpion. Oh, I don't have enough. Gotta go salvage that. I don't think I'm going to worry about that. I guess I am. Heading that way now, Commander. Oh, Jesus Christ, that's a manticore. Oh, that's bad. To course, Jesus Christ. Okay, switching over to the Ruby. Mm. Target acquired. Missile. You know what I probably should be doing? Staying within the base. Target destroyed. Share target engaged. Target destroyed. Copy on share target. Secondary objective. Why can I still see this activate scorpion? Thank you. And now I can't switch. There we go. Do not allow any turrets to be destroyed. Oh, okay. Um. Try to stay here. Lens relocation confirmed. I do want to spawn that scorpion spawner. And some uh, some tanks to, to help out would be nice. Okay. Oh, for God's sake! It still keeps doing it. I can't remember how to get in there. I get into this building? I don't remember <laughs> which side I came out on. Yep, he was stuck up in the sky, okay.
Yes, upgrade the PPC turret. the way in. <laughs> There's a manticore wave coming? Oh shit. I'm screwed. I want more PPC towers, that's what I want. There's a PPC turret. Okay. Are they already inside? No, they're on the other side. Okay. Look at them all. This is bad. <laughs> this is very bad. What is this? A ravager. Damn this. That's the PBC turret. Can I upgrade that? Also, can I get out on this side? No, I cannot. Okay, yeah, this base layout sucks. Well, that AMS is doing work. Man. Commander, we have lost one of our medium laser turrets. You don't say. Looked like he had lost uh weapon. Mobile units on radar. Target acquired. Oh now I can see them. This could get rough. These are a lot of pigeon tanks, man. Missions are harder. I may have bitten off a lot more than I can chew. One thing we do need to do get within range of the base defenses. Stay there. Oh, shit. Okay, we're doing it. We're doing it. This is a much, uh, much better build than I was thinking. We're on it, Commander. Destroy. Okay. Thirty-eight seconds to prepare for the next wave. Or Ravager turret. Ah, oh, come on. Seventy. Okay. Actually, let's put that up. So that's four AC twos. That's that's a pretty mean. Okay, there's four hostile units coming now. And a
use this, can I? Yeah, of course we did in front of all of this. Another VTOL swarm, just what the doctor ordered. All right. There's a turret, I'll take that. This is a lot of flyers. Enable that Ravager turret. Oh, never mind. We oh, come on. We are gonna get out of here and go right for extraction. The door opens a ton. <laughs> I would stick around, but. Ooh, complete the final wave for a light mech reward. We're sticking around. Oh, damn, I shouldn't have done that. Okay. One on him. And I'm going to go in. i go in here and pick up the thing that gives us ammo. Well, I don't think it really matters. I don't use ammo. He doesn't... Yeah, I, I don't need to. Come on, look what we got coming this way. <laughs> up on the tower, right? Commander, we have lost one of our AC-2 turrets. Ooh, taking some headshots here. Okay. Look at that. We haven't even shot at that mech yet. Our defenses are doing it. Yep. 
And we're gonna let that happen. <laughs> I do wish I could get a vantage and look down. Yeah, see, they're on the other side of the wall. I knew I'd take down that mech. Take down that mech? You didn't take down a mech. What are you talking about? Incoming missile. Boom. As you can see, that AMS turret is doing work. Love it. And this tank is still out here being a boss. Copy on champ target. Boom. Target mech destroyed. <laughs> Did he actually get inside? Copy that target. No, okay. Target destroyed. Oh crap, destroy the headhunter mechs. Ada with a PPC. Oh, they're just light mechs, okay. I'll upgrade it too. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, I am... Oh god damn it. Locust? Yes. Well, obviously a locust. Enemy make destroyed. Target acquired. So I stuck around in order to get a light mech. Yeah, so I stuck around. Oh, right in the face, that hurt. I stuck around to get a light mech and then lost my light mech anyway. Noticing a theme here though, like we're we're losing Max. They're locusts. They're locusts. But we got a Jenner. We got a good Jenner. Oh worth it. Absolutely worth it. And we could take ah, I'm gonna say I thought we could take the parts for a Jenner. Or a Cicada as well. Any equipment that we want? No, this is all kind of crap. I'll take that. Supercharger. That's not a bad thing to have. Our map. We we're doing the ground ground war just yet. So let's head back here. Quick repairs, check out our new mech. Sounds like a plan to me. Oh, it's totally destroyed. Sell it. I'm not wasting the money on that. Let's check this bad boy out. 35 ton mech. I will never understand why they do that. Got a supercharger. But he's running 113 kilometers an hour. I think I wanted. I don't care for this. One and a half tons. I don't think I really need that. Though. Okay. 
Save the weight. Put it on a different mech. Max the armor. If I had another meat, do they have another medium chem laser? Medium laser arrays. The problem is we don't have much money to buy stuff. No, they don't have another medium chem laser. Otherwise, I put put those in. But here we go. This is a perfectly acceptable mech. The heating is good, or the cooling is good. It's stupidly fast. It has more than enough rounds. Yeah. Cool. I've got to keep that in mind. More in mind for the uh, uh, those missions if I can get mechs out of them. Okay, let's take barrel. Ninety-seven. I don't really need the Clint to go that fast. We can save money on a smaller engine. One ninety. I can do it. I can do it. Take this. Take the one ninety. Now we've got eight tons. Too many jump jets and stuff. Yeah, I'm already over. I knew it. Okay, well we've we've got the engine that we want for it. So for the time being, we're just gonna barrel. Drop the jump jets. Much money. God. We are so scraping the barrel right now. All right. Neither of these people like us. Maybe, we'll, oh, we can't get there. Attack and defend? No, not, not right now. Let's do this ground war. Check them out. Contra. Ground war. Now this time we are we, we've definitely got to let our enemies or not our enemies, our friendly allies go ahead. chances. I'll keep it like that. Ooh. Actually, I'm going to run the Jenner. This guy's best at laser, so he'll get the urban mech. Oh, and before we jump in, weapon control groups are perfectly fine. And a job. There we go. There we go. All right, let's see how this mech does. I like the fact that we're using chem lasers again. I didn't really get to it in the last episode, but I do enjoy them. It, it balances itself out. Overall, I like regular lasers better because you don't need the ammo. But at the same time, you could put more lasers in a mech 
if you have the, the weight limits for it uh, with the chem lasers and not draw, draw uh, generate heat. You can just constantly fire, which is nice. We got here. Yep, and then, okay, they're all light mechs. At least that javelin's useful. This one here, which Glass Cannon AI is his name, even. An LRM 15 on a javelin is absolutely pointless to me. Shot. That is real. Now, I can tell you this. With the um, biome that we're in right now, you can see that it is kind of hard on the frame rate. That also makes it hard to fight. I am going to let these guys all go first. And start taking enemies out, and I'll pick off the guys on the outside. I am absolutely not opposed to using them. Alright, what do we got here? Data, decent, half decent one. Mongoose is decent. Why is the panther completely broken? And an AC-20 hunchback for the commander. Okay. Hopefully with this mission we might be able to find Whitworth parts. Or a couple more Centurion parts, that'd be nice. Burning a free mech, though, makes me want to do another ground war. Maybe we'll do that next. Oh. What are you guys doing? like taking the super long way by the looks of it like the first group obviously knows where the enemy are a bit they're still moving that way and these guys are pointed that way too why aren't they moving there they go Okay, they've engaged, so... Somebody is causing my systems havoc. I hate it. I need to control the urban mech for this. I need to be able to do that alpha strike damage. That. Cleared my mech, heading back to base. I don't know what the uh, commander's shooting at, but we're gonna go for it. I gotta keep him alive. Look at that, almost took him out. There we go. Oh. oh, I was gonna say. This guy here. These guys are nasty. Now, 
Now here's the thing. Oh, look at that. Getting him with the AC-20. Nice. If that mech was solely focusing on me because he's overheating me with his weapons, he could keep me soft locked there forever. It's a pain in the ass. And no, I can't shoot through here. I don't know why. Hello. There we go. And you notice? Yeah, that didn't hit Now our screen is clear from the ECM. That's another thing we got to start paying attention to. We need ECM. Electronic countermeasures and our version of it. Attacking from position. The component blew off like it was nothing. Target acquired. Do what I can, sir. Actually, no. We want to. We want to go around this way. I don't want to get that commander. Although we're doing good. If you get a commander, you kill them. I believe it brings in more reinforcements for you. That's it. Show me your back, little one. Okay, got it. Still alive. Objected. Heading back to base. Lance attack confirmed. I'm gonna go for his head. I think I gotta back off a bit. Yeah, it'd be nice if you got your AC twenty out there, boss. Holy cow. Total miss. Moving on, lens target. Today's not your day. This is for now. I think I got him, sir. Weapons on tag target. Target acquired. I would absolutely take a fire starter too, by the way. Target destroyed. What? My mic is going critical? No. Hmm? Calling Eagles. Yes. I've ejected and left the battle. Got that shot. Man, I'm about to lose my left side. Come on, guys, get him. I've got my target. This is burnout. That took care of him. Stop it. Stop shooting at me. I don't want to lose my left side. There we go. I don't think we lost any of our teammates. Although there does look to be two more after this the commander. Three more, maybe? Target destroyed. Yeah, now we get reinforcements. Jesus, get it out of time. Oh, Take them out for me. The last two are obviously down here somewhere. I don't want to push this though. Look at my left my left torso. Oh my god, could it be further away?
Is he stuck in the ship? There's somebody's getting him. Okay. Oh, please don't glitch out after all of this. I've got my target. Yep. Ship couldn't leave with him. <laughs> because of it. Okay, we have one more mech. Oh, is it that one? I don't see a mech. Yeah, it's because it tried to land on a building. There we go. I'll take care of it. That would have sucked if the mission glitched out at this point. Watches a mech punches a guy in battle armor in the face. There we go. Wow. Oh, this has been an epic episode as well. I hope you enjoyed it, folks. Give me a thumbs up in the, and your thoughts in the comments if you did. Like and subscribe to help me grow. <laughs> This has been great. Early game keeps you on your toes so much. I could take another cicada. Parts for a cicada. Or I could get the fire starter. This is the way. That would be nice, but you need ammo for them. I'm not really sold on the haywires. I tried it out in an earlier build. This would be nice. Can't afford it though, but right here. We just lost yet another mech, and we have a locust we have to replace. This is the way. Ooh. Oh no, we only need three. Oh, I can't take it. Javelin parts. Oh, nothing really all that spectacular here either. So, whoops. That one perfect. And this is like I said, we have a Phoenix, a hero Phoenix Hawk now, and a tier 60 pilot, but he starts low. We're gonna use Goblin. However, for now, we're gonna go on cold storage. I'm not going to use it until we've gotten at least one mech on our own past that. So. How much is this going to cost to assemble? Just under what I have. Oof, that was close. I have to repair these guys. And then we're going to have to find some more trouble, some more missions. And that will be for the next episode. Man, the early game is great. I love it. It just, it's a nail biter. But I love it so much. I hope you guys did enjoy it as well. Like I said, give me a thumbs up if so. Till next time though, I've been Rage of Games and I seriously hope you enjoyed this. Catch you in the next one.